While the president-elect remained out of sight today, there were visible signs that Barack Obama is moving with deliberate speed in his transition to the White House. The senator from Illinois today resigned his Senate seat in a farewell letter, thanking the men and women of this great state who made my life in public service possible. But there have been no public pronouncements yet regarding an Obama cabinet. Speculation, to be sure. Senator Hillary Rodham Clinton, Mr. Obama's Democratic rival, is said to be leading the list for Secretary of State, despite her protestations. I'm not going to speculate or address anything about the president-elect's incoming administration. The idea got support today from both sides of the aisle. It seems to me uh, she's got the experience, uh, she's got the temperament for it. I think she'd be a fine choice. Mr. Obama did announce the appointment of more White House this staffers today. Pete Rouse as senior advisor and deputy um, chiefs of staff Jim Messina one. and Mona Sutphin, a former Clintonite. In fact, 31 of the 47 Obama hires so far have ties to Bill Clinton's administration. Well, in a sense, it's not that surprising. There's only been one Democratic president in the last 30 years or so. So it's not too shocking that a lot of the people who Obama would pick have worked for that Democratic president. Obama may have learned more from the Clinton era. Former Clinton press secretary D.D. Like Myers cites the president's admission that he made a mistake in first focusing on cabinet selections rather than his White House staff. Your first weeks are... What are the first moves you make? What are the, you know, what, what is your agenda? How do you spend your first 100 days? Almost all of that is going to come uh, primarily, not entirely, but primarily from the White House. And Mr. Obama will be relying somewhat on his rival for the presidency. He'll be meeting with Senator John McCain in Chicago tomorrow, in part to talk about how the new White House can work well with the Senate. Russ? They assure us at the White House.